What is up everyone? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be talking about some speculation here because we are officially on Animal Crossing Update Watch. Okay, we are at the end of the month, which generally means Nintendo has something up their sleeve. There's been a lot of speculation of the next 2.0 update. And honestly, the community right now is very div divisive on like whether or not this will happen, whether or not they will wait till a later date. We're gonna be talking about this. At the end of this video, I actually want you guys to put in the comments, A, will they have an update? And if they do have an update, what will be in it? And when will it happen? There's a lot of questions. Hopefully I provide some of these answers. So I put a poll over on the community tab and I said, do you think we will have an ACNH update trailer this week? Okay, and I said, look out for the results. It's this video that we're talking about. Now, I do think there's a lot of evidence pointing towards, yeah, we will be getting one, but also I could see the other side of the coin where Nintendo might wait a little bit. Kind of give us a breather. They've been packing updates. We'll get into everything in a bit, but I'm gonna discuss every single answer in this poll. Starting with the 23% on the low end, uh, and you guys said no, no update this month. No update this month, Pat, you're crazy. You think this week will be a trailer? You're insane. Let's talk about this, okay? There's a lot of evidence that could back this up. Now let's start off with, with thinking this. There's no update trailer this week. There's none even this month. Uh, that would kind of be a bummer. Considering Nintendo has gone above and beyond, so far at least, by providing a ton of content for this year. We're in a very weird situation where we are in year two of Animal Crossing. I really thought that Nintendo was going to take it easy as far as updates, but they've actually done the opposite. We've had the Pave event. Last month was packed with three updates, including the Sanrio, the Mario, and the quality of life year anniversary update. So they've been going above and beyond. I mean, as far compared to my expectations, they've been doing some crazy stuff. So no update this month would be a little bit of a change of pace, but maybe they want to save some bigger things for bigger events. That could be the key here. So let's let's go ahead to June. All right, we're skipping a couple months here, but June 12th to the 15th is a giant event, E3. Okay, now E3 is where all the major video game companies show off their plans, show off their hardware, show off the upcoming games and really get people excited. And E3 might be the time where the next Animal Crossing update lies. It's a big stage. People will uh, will have uh, full focus on whatever Nintendo has for Animal Crossing. And Animal Crossing has been proven to be slotted into these bigger presentations. Earlier this year, we saw Animal Crossing slotted into the Nintendo Direct where they announced the Mario update. And I believe Animal Crossing was even revealed in a E3 or Nintendo Direct. So that's not out of the question. And especially considering that the next update for this game will be 2.0. And that's another thing we need to discuss here because we are currently on 1.9. There's been some speculation that it'll be 1.9A or 1.9B, but 2.0 seems the most likely. Now, why is that so important? 2.0 generally, signifies a turning point for a game. 2.0, anytime a game gets a 2.0 update, usually a lot of things are changing. Usually the game is evolving. And for a game like Animal Crossing, that could mean bigger and better things. We'll get to exactly what they could add later in the video, but I think that's important to know E3 is on its way and 2.0 generally is a huge update for games, which is very exciting, but also could make this team wait a little bit. Another point to add is that where would this update fit in? Now, there is a large gap in the Animal Crossing calendar, which mainly points to summer. So announcing something now or having a big update now, the timing doesn't seem that right to me. Summer seems like a giant update, maybe the possible addition of Cap'n or a mini game island, like I'm looking at you, Tortimer. The summer looks like it could be slated to have a giant Animal Crossing update. I'm leaning more towards a multiplayer update, but that summer slot just makes so much sense. Imagine them uh, announcing something in May or at E3 and then having a giant summer of Animal Crossing newness. To me, that sounds amazing and quite likely. I'm still banking on a giant summer update, 
when will that happen? Will the next update be 1.9a and then the 2.0 in the summer? Or will they just go crazy and announce a 2.0 update this week? The next percentage of people said nope. That was 28% said no, answering the question, will there be an update trailer this week? Now, this could mean a bunch of things. Uh, a solid no compared to the not this month could mean maybe we get one next week or maybe we get one in May. That is possible, but sort of unlikely. There's a lot of things happening in May. It's either gonna get announced this week or next week or in the summer, like we said before, May Day. There's a lot of things that need to be updated. The Museum Day event was kind of lackluster. You got plaques. It, it wasn't really a uh, well-received event. And Nintendo has already shown that they are willing to update certain events. Uh, we saw with Bunny Day, instead of a two-week event, they changed it to one week. And they even added in new items for Bunny Day. So an event like Museum Day, I did make a whole prediction video, by the way, already on this. But Museum Day could point to the data mines of Brewster possibly be being added into this game. Uh, that would also insinuate gyroids being introduced to this game, which is a collectible that you get after it rains. So after it rains, you see little dig spots similar to fossils. You dig them up and you have gyroids. So Museum Day, Brewster. I know Brewster has been predicted to death, but if he's going to happen, it's either going to be now or in the fall when coffee and hot chocolate comes out and things like that. But a museum day update, especially, you know, leaf came this time last year. So new plants, new flowers, new fruit trees, perhaps. A lot of it's pointing towards this. So the 28% saying no, maybe you're a little bit pessimistic on Nintendo. You don't have the faith that I do, but I think it was worth discussing the 28% more so, maybe not this week, but a good chance next week. Next up, we need to talk about the percentage that a lot of you guys hope will happen, and that is the 49% saying, yeah, we're gonna get an update. 100%, the trailer will drop this week. Now, I think this is the most interesting option. Of course, as an Animal Crossing player and fan, I want to see another update trailer this week. But we got to talk about this. What could be in the update trailer big enough to, to warrant a trailer? Because the last update came via a Twitter post. Now, I think that the last update was one of the best, but it wouldn't have showed well. 50 new custom design slots, the ability to uh, customize cutouts and flags and things like that. It's really hard to make that show well in a trailer like... How would you make a trailer saying, oh yeah, you have 50 new custom design slots? Like people wanna see that, but I don't think that's necessarily the most attractive trailer that they can do. So will we get a trailer or will we get a Twitter post? I think that's the better question, but 49% of you think that yeah, we will get a trailer, which is a pretty significant number. I think if we do get a trailer, uh, it will be on the Nintendo YouTube channel, of course. And I actually waited to make this video after 9 a.m. Eastern because that's when they announce a lot of things. But the fact that Nintendo would release a trailer would mean big things would come to this game. I'm talking like Brewster, Katrina, some, some crazy stuff. So that could warrant a trailer. And also with the 2.0 update, I could definitely see a trailer. Now let's go to the other side. They don't release a trailer, but they release an update, meaning that some quality of life things may be getting updated. Now, like I was saying before, the last uh, update didn't get a trailer, but it added a lot of cool features. Like we have a, a custom kiosk right in the palm of our hands and we have all of these custom designs, which I still haven't filled up. And I still have old patterns. I, st I st still think I have like Christmas patterns. And there's a lot of evidence pointing towards quality of life being the way of the future in terms of Animal Crossing updates. We got the custom design slots already. Uh, the new things that we can customize. The biggest thing right now is this guy right here, and that is uh, quality of life improvements involving crafting. The biggest thing being this guy right here, and that is fish bait. I would love to see batch crafting being implemented into this game. And I feel like I'm a broken record. The year one, we talked a lot about batch crafting before, but there's more evidence pointing towards Nintendo wanting to help out players and I don't want to talk about this, but year two and year three could 
lead up to the eventual end of updates for Animal Crossing. I think at the end of Animal Crossing's life, we're going to have a complete game. So is Nintendo really going to want to leave features like batch crafting and new terraforming features out of the complete game? I think this could happen. Batch crafting, bulk buying at Ables, things like this will eventually get fixed. It's more of a question of when, but it's super exciting because like one fish bait at a time, I'm trying to fish all day, all right? Not just one at a time. So there you go. There's some arguments. There's some counter arguments for a, the next Animal Crossing update. I definitely think it could happen. It could happen as early as this Thursday or Friday. If not Thursday or Friday, you're looking at next week, probably around that Tuesday mark. Guys, do not get worried if they skip this month. I do think that's a possibility as well. They could be gearing up for a giant Animal Crossing summer update that could either be shown next month or at E3. Let me know in the comments what you think. Will we be getting one this week or this month or next month? And what is the number one thing you guys want to see? Because there is a lot to fix in this game. There's a lot that they could add to this game. I think all of us want an Animal Crossing update. I think that's that's the general consensus here. And it's not being it's not us being greedy. I want to just throw that out there. I don't think it's necessarily us being greedy for an update. It's that we love this game and we just want to keep playing it. That's the, that's the that's the bottom line there. So thank you guys for watching. I am going to get, just scour Nintendo's YouTube for that next update. Also follow them on Twitter because they might drop it on there. Either way, I'll be talking about it, reacting to it, whatever. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you very soon. New update!